Okay, so this is my latest spin of my board to add sound chips, namely the YM2149 to the W65C265SXB development board by Western Design Center. And the good news is it makes noise. So there I have a descending scale coming out of one speaker and an ascending scale coming out the other. So that's very exciting, but there is something very strange going on. To demonstrate the strangeness, let me run an alternate program that just plays the ascending scale on one of the channels. And let's take a look at the code. So to change the pitch, you have to write to a fine tone register, register zero, and a coarse tone register, register one. And the way you write to it is you write to one address that specifies what register you want to write to, and then another address that specifies the data you're writing to that register. Notice something weird about this code. I write to each register twice, and I need to do that in order for it to work. And it really bothers me because I have no idea why. I found this out through trial and error. I think there's a hint here. Notice I'm using an indexed mode here in order to write the data. And actually, I should mention one of my students originally wrote this code, and I've been modifying it since then. Here's an alternate version of the code where I unrolled the loop and didn't use that X register index mode. And to get this to work, I actually had to add some no-ops in here. So it looks like the same sort of thing I found with my TMS9918, although technically it was the TMS9118 video board I made for this thing. And let's see, I actually have that sitting here somewhere. Ah, here's my new version of the video board. Fortunately, I took this home to test, but I'd forgotten to put in all of the chips. So that's embarrassing. I need to go back and get the chips. Anyway, in order to get this to work, I needed to put some no-ops here. Oh, the reason I brought this board is I have to put in no-ops in order to get it to work. Otherwise, this microcontroller can write too fast to this old chip and it gets upset. And it looks like we have a similar thing going on with the sound chips here. So I had to put some no-ops here. So I thought, well, maybe it's just a delay issue that I just need a ton of delay between writing this register and eventually writing the fine tone. But if I take this bit out here and just stick in tons and tons of no-ops, no matter how many no-ops I use, it doesn't work. Just for fun, let me take the no-ops out and show you what happens. Okay, let's listen to that program without the no-ops. So here I'm getting a C major 7 chord. It's skipping every other note. Very strange. <laughs> 